Hello, this is Ian Kilbarn, Energy Systems Engineering Technology at St. Lawrence College, Kingston, Ontario, Canada. Okay, this is a recording on how to model building envelope upgrades in Red Screen Expert. First thing you want to do is to look at your comparison report and make sure that your base case and your proposed case are completely the same. So if I come in here, I've got base case, proposed case. You can see that uh, my consumption is the same in both cases and my savings equals zero. Uh, once I've confirmed that, I can come back and I can start looking at upgrades. So I'll go back here to my zone one building envelope. Uh, I've just got some walls on here base and proposed case. So if I'd like to know uh, what is the effect of adding some more insulation to these walls. Uh, these walls right now are all linked to a wall properties worksheet down here. Um, but uh, I don't need to use that, change that worksheet if I don't want to. Um, in fact, if I change the worksheet, it's going to change the base case as well. So what I'll do is uh, just come in here and I'm going to just overwrite these numbers uh, by the amount of insulation I wanted to add. Um, if I wanted to add another R20 then I would be up to 36.6. Um, I'm just going to say uh, I'm going to take these all to make them uh, R40 walls. So I'll upgrade those all to R40 like that and then just whip over here to comparison take a look at this and I can see that uh, my consumption has gone from 346 to 320 and my savings is $25. When I am done with that I come back to uh, building envelope again and I can come in here now and if I just hit this button and I can reset my proposed case back to my base case confirm that by looking at comparison, savings is zero, and I'm ready to go to do another upgrade test. Don't change your base case numbers when you're doing upgrade uh, work. If you do that, you'll lose track of what they're supposed to be. Um, always keep your base case intact and make the changes over here in your proposed case. It doesn't matter uh, what you're changing, whether you're doing air leakage, uh, building envelopes, furnaces, keep it all over in proposed case. Make sure that your savings are zero before you start so that you're not carrying some phantom savings in and getting confused. Pretty simple. That's all there is to it.